this video will show you exactly how to use the Deputy Kiosk. To access your account, please first find your name in the employee list. After selecting your name within the list, please input your four digit PIN. If you have lost your PIN, please touch what's my PIN. After logging in, you will have access to your company announcements. To start your shift, please click on the green start shift button. If you are not rostered to work, you will need to select the area you will be working in. When ready to start your shift, you will be required to take a photo. This photo will use face detection to detect if your face is in the picture. After successfully starting your shift, you will be shown your current tasks. To complete a task, please select the checkbox next to the task. To view your upcoming shifts or to see who is working with you, click on the calendar icon. From the calendar view, I can quickly see where my upcoming shifts are. If I touch on the days that my shifts are on, I will see the details of when I'm scheduled. If I select any of the employees I'm working with, I will also see the details of when they are working. Within this calendar, I can also see my past shifts worked and when I am unavailable. To simulate taking a break, I will log out, let some time pass, and then log back in. To take your break, simply select Take Break, and then log out and take your break. After your break is finished, you'll need to re-log in and end your break. To end your shift at the end of the day, please re-log in and touch End Shift. On ending your shift, you will also need to take another photo. If the photo successfully detects your face, your shift will end and your timesheet will be submitted. I will now explain some of the additional features within the Deputy Kiosk. To make an announcement, please touch Announcement. From here, you can create your announcement. To create a task, please touch Task. From here, you can set a task title, due date, who you wish to assign this to, and a comment. To set when you're unavailable, please touch Unavailability. From here, you can set the date, if it will repeat, and the exact time you might be unavailable. To submit a leave request, please touch leave. From here, you can select the start date, end date, the reason you are going away, and who you wish to notify. You should now be able to operate the deputy kiosk.